joy, 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 joy down in my heart Where? Down in my heart to stay And I'm so happy, so very happy I've got the love of Jesus in my heart down in my heart And I'm so happy, so very happy I've got the love of Jesus in my heart What else you got? I've got the peace that passes understanding down in my heart Where? Down in Understanding down in my heart Where? Down in my heart to stay And I'm so happy, so very happy I've got the love of Jesus in my heart Down in my heart And I'm so happy, so very happy I've got the love of Jesus in my heart I've got the wonderful love of my blessed reading Away down in the depths of my heart Where? Down in the depths of my heart Where? Down in the depths of my heart I've got the wonderful love of my blessed reading Away down in the depths of my heart Where? children today god has blessed us with life are you happy to be alive yes so today i'm going to tell you about something we call testimony we call testimony a testimony is given in church when someone comes to church and tell us something that god has done for us has god done something for us yes dear and i would like you to tell the children online about our testimony Hi, so my name is Dion and I have a testimony. Um, Michelle had a broken arm. I prayed for her and she had a cast. The next Sunday, she, she didn't have the cast. Wow, let's clap for Jesus. Clap for Jesus, Maria. Yes, our God is good and he heard Dion's prayer and Michelle was healed. Michelle, were you healed? Yes. Say with the mic. Were you healed? Yes. Where, which hand was broken? Can you show the people the hand that was broken? Do you see children? She no longer has a cast because we prayed for her. Dion prayed for her in Sunday school and God had and the following Sunday she came without a cast. Now I want to teach you about prayer and about God healing us. In the book of Isaiah, open your Bibles. Children, I'm always telling you to have a Bible. So in the book of Isaiah, chapter 53, go to chapter 53, verse 5, and it says, But he was pierced for our transgressions. He was crushed for our iniquities, the punishment that brought peace was in him. And by his wounds, we are healed. By his wounds, we are healed. By his wounds, we are healed. Do you know that Jesus was crucified? Yes. yes. Was Jesus really crucified? Yes. yes. Did they walk with him laughing to the cross? No. How did they go to the cross? Crying, crying. Leon, when Jesus was being taken to the cross, were they laughing? No. What were they doing? Beating Jesus. Yes, they were beating Jesus. And those are what we call the stripes on his back. On his back. Or the stripes on his back. So, because Jesus was crucified because he was beaten, we can get healed. And when we pray to God, we tell God, God, please heal us because Jesus Christ was beaten up so that he could have wounds that could heal us, that could heal us. So children, before we say goodbye to the, ch to the children online, I, would w I want you to say a memory verse. Huh? Memory verse. Here, Leon, here, lead us with the memory verse. 
John 3.16, it is says, From God so loved the world, that he gave his only begotten Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. Wonderful. Thank you so much, children. Thank you for the testimony. And I know you now know that Jesus loves children. Does Jesus love children? Yes. Does Jesus hear our prayers, children? Yes. We do you ever be afraid to pray for someone who is sick? No. Yes. yes. I'm so happy. You. I want to end with a word of prayer. Or oh, would you like to sing a song? You'd like to sing a song? Father Abraham, how many sons, how many sons, so Father Abraham, I am one of them, and so are you, so let us praise them.